Byzantines versus Tatars. Okay. Yeah, I try to focus up. I kind of want to win this game. I'm already down 0-2. It's kind of, uh, kind of a lot. You know what I mean? Can't go down 0-3. Did you change the name of this account? Yeah, I did. No worries, Viper lost 7 0 Theo. That's uh, true, that's a good point. Oh, no, no loom. I don't really like Byzantines, but I'll, I'll do the best with them, I guess. Do what I can versus Tatars. Might want to play. Hmm. Probably Archer opening, I guess. Yeah, probably Archer into Skirm opening. Makes sense. Nikov says Benzina OP. Oh, I, th I think they're a pretty good sieve. I'm just not a fan of them myself. This is one of the sieves that I just personally don't really like, but I respect as a good sieve or like a decent sieve. I don't know about them being OP though. What is a good tip for someone who is new to learn? Ask my business teams. I have videos on YouTube, uh, top five tips for beginners, and also a beginner sift tier list that you can check out to get like a full on opinion. But business teams are pretty cool. They're not bad for beginners. Crazy I can re chat and play at the same time, I know. Years of practice, my, my man. He says to always have matchup advantage. Ooh, that's a bold claim. Even versus Mezosivs. I mean, I, I I can see some truth to that from Nikov, for sure. Um, while I would say they often have matchup advantage, I also say that they're not a very proactive sieve. So oftentimes you gotta give up priority, and I think a lot of a lot of things can go wrong if you give up prio on the early game. I played Byzantine as a kid because they, were, they had the most complete tech tree. It's actually wrong. I'm pretty sure Saracens have a more complete tech tree than Byzantine, to be honest. Yeah, but Byzantine do have a good good tech tree, obviously. Will Slam be an AM? Uh, I don't think so. We don't really have any plans to take Slam. Not that he's a bad player or anything. I actually really enjoy playing with Slam like on Nations Cup. I think he's a great player. Um... But I just think that if we're gonna pick up someone else, it'd probably be someone who is like part of like the younger guys coming up. Even though they might not have the same experience, I think we're looking for a bit more like time investment than the drive. So w what was the conclusion on the Karambit Chatel guys? Ages, I'm shaking my head, sorry. Ref rest, thanks to the Prime stuff, appreciate it. And looking for a new member? Um, I, I wouldn't say we're necessarily looking for one, but we always have our, our options open, for sure. Sixty karambits versus thirty chatel. Twenty-eight karambits remain. Okay, so karambits easily win. Confirmed. Uh, guys, thank you so much for looking into that because, um, yeah, it's one of those things where I didn't know I lost the matchup and hopefully next time if I see that matchup in the tournament, I'll just be able to win it with Karambits and thank the chat. Yo, what's up, Frez? Will AM remove the older players like MBL? I don't think we're planning to. We're not. We're not going to remove someone based on their age. I think if we ever remove someone, it has to be because they did something really wrong, or if they're just not, uh, you know, taking the game seriously anymore or whatnot. But in general, I, I really don't see us removing someone at this point. Um, now it would have to be because something massive happened, and you know, I just don't see that happening. I guess. Not AM without MBL. 
that. What about Raby Flare? Nah, he's trash. He's O2 versus Mr. Yo. Disgrace. I think he's gonna militia rush me. So scary, man. <laughs> it's like a horror movie. Wasn't the cleanest defense I've ever done. I think I have to go two ranges. Is this map open though? Nah, it looks really good. Nah. If it's really good, we can't do two ranges. Unless we tower forward. Nah, still. Oh, what? what? He's, he's so aggressive. What's the busy event? The tower is here. I don't necessarily want to go arch though. Eventually, I want to switch to skirms, I believe. Ah, I would just have to stay on defense here. Should I get armor? Nah, I think I need to rush castle though, that's the thing.
Uh, I'm going up to castle for no reason here. Really good tower reaction for me. It might save me. Once again, though, I'm just stuck doing nothing, basically. <laughs> Tiger, thanks for the raid. No, we just have to get DCs. I, I can't even make camels. Because what, what am I going to do? Attack him with camels and a few scurves? That's so weak. So I think what I have to do is just get some economy ro rolling. Kind of the same game as last time, which I don't really like. I need to get freaking, uh, what's it called? Town Patrol. I can kill that scout. One more. Nice. There, oh, I just saw it. Gonna need a monastery, though, guaranteed. Hmm. Oh, I didn't get a horse collar. No, no, no. No, I'm not gonna make the same mistake as last game. Come on. Like in theory, my position's still fine because I'm on skirms, which is what Byzantine wants to do. To it. Leave him be. He's still feudal. Ah, maybe my fast castle is not looking that bad at all of a sudden. Hold on. Town patrol is actually good though. Yeah, this scene feels kind of nice, not gonna lie. There's little things like this town patrol that uh, makes me enjoy this of. Can I snag one relic before the game even starts? Just okay. He's definitely going step monsters. He just completely wasted those guys. I'm gonna get a stable. Like no way if he's gonna go crossbow, he's that careless, right? So based on that, he's definitely going either light cav or step monsters or both, or like knights, like any kind of cavalry basically. I'm gonna try to snag the relic. Maybe this relic as well. Just snag the relics before the game even begins. A celebrate 420? No. Aha! Pretty satisfying when you call it like that. This is the good part about your opponents being really good. You just know they're not going to make a mistake. So if they do something stupid like that, like, it seems stupid, you know it's for a reason. And the reason is, they're not gonna go for crossbows. So you can kinda get ahead. At lower levels, you can't really do this kind of stuff as easily, cause like, 
oh, he just ran four crossbows in, or four archers into my TC. Is he going crossbows or is he bad? And you don't really know. Yeah, free time patrol is actually great. No, 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 not house, guys, not house. It's the worst thing that can happen. Yeah, everywhere he goes, I just know. <laughs> Sometimes, like, I say go back to work, but they're, they're on a farm and they just leave the farm. It's kind of annoying. Okay, I'll just go camels here. Oh, he tricked me. Not the best fight, actually. I don't know what, where she's going. Nor are you. I have no upgrades. <laughs> Oops. I need pl I need plus one uh, armor if I can fight. I keep losing random bills. It's really annoying. Oh, he's gonna drop a castle soon. I think is that what is that what that was? Yeah. Eh, can't really fight it. We'll go with that area.
Any transition I have to make besides just camels, actually? Now that, now that I'm thinking about it, isn't this, this, this matchup just camels for me? I mean, he can go halps. He, in fact, he has to go halps to counter me. Kind of his only choice. Oh, that's uh, quite annoying. We did snag two relics, by the way. Like I said, before the game really even started. And those guys are definitely helping out right now. I love doing that. Just like right, like right away, just pick up the relics. He's gonna go for uh, just a treadboar, basically. Uh, I think I want to go Rams then. Step on is a pretty good wrist Rams though, but whatever. I mean, what, what can I do? Whoa, 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 fight. Everything is stuck. Oh, Byzantine Castle stays up. That's just so brutal, man. I, he has six trebuchets and I keep my castle up. <laughs> he has six trebuchets and my castle's half HP is not even phased. That is literally crazy. Oh, uh, this matchup is so free though. I forgot how easy this matchup was in late game. Like, I made that way harder on myself than it had to be. All I had to do was go like scout to the camels, literally. As long as you don't die to their um to their crossbows, they have no units later that can deal with camels besides halves, and their halves aren't great, obviously. GG. I, I kind of like the Rams, to be honest. I think the Rams help out a lot in the Treb War. They're, they're somewhat underrated. If you have only one castle versus two, you can literally just go like Ram push, especially with melee units. They're just so, so strong. Didn't feel like a win because it was so messy, but... The building HP plus the town patrol, it's just like small bonuses like that that just really add up.